Well, it's tough when a child has to be in a hospital. And so this summer, staff members at a couple of Green Bay hospitals came up with an idea to try to help ease the pain of their youngest patients. They grew a pumpkin patch. Fox 11's Angela Kelly shows us how the fruits of their labor are making a difference. We got about 25, 30 pumpkins that we're going to harvest today. These bright orange gourds are a welcome sight for members of the green team. This pumpkin patch fits perfectly with their mission as employees to make St. Mary's Hospital and its sister hospital, St. Vincent, more environmentally friendly. We heal patients, but in order to heal patients, we need to heal the environment too because they go together as one. With the harvest complete, it's time to make a special delivery. And it's here on the pediatrics floor of St. Vincent Hospital where the green team's efforts are truly making a difference. Pain, pain, pain. The pumpkins have become the patient's latest art projects. It's a nice break for five year old Jonathan, who's been fighting a respiratory illness for the last three days. Kids of all ages are enjoying these pumpkins. Right down the hall from young Jonathan's room is 13-year-old Briley Kemp's, and she's working on her masterpiece as we speak. Mama. A neurogenetic yeah, disorder mama. known as Angel Man Syndrome limits Briley's ability to talk, but her colorful personality shines through in her artwork. Beautiful. Moments like this are what members of St. Vincent's Child Life Department strive for. And a lot of it is through normalizing the hospital setting, through play and through art and crafts and um, all kinds of fun things, just to make sure that the hospital is as fun as can be. And the green team is happy to help make that happen. Next year, they hope to grow an even larger pumpkin patch and possibly a community garden. In Green Bay, Angela Kelly, Fox 11 News. By the way, St. Vincent and St. Mary's Green Team got some help with their pumpkin patch from a landscaping company that did the tilling and from a greenhouse that donated the pumpkin plants.